Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about exponential equations not requiring logarithms. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here. 81 times 9 to the negative 2b minus 2 equals 27, and we want to solve this equation. Well, each one of these, the 81, the 9, and the 27, can be written as 3 to some power. 81 is 3 to the 4th power. 9 is 3 squared. We keep the rest, negative 2b minus 2 in the exponent. And 27 is 3 to the 3rd power. That's going to be important soon. Now, simplifying here, the 3 to the 4th power stays there. But our rules state... When we raise something that's an exponent to another exponent, we multiply the exponents. So this is 3 to the 2 power times a negative 2b minus 2. And that's equal 3 to the 3rd power. All right. We now have the same base of 3, and it's being multiplied. And in our rule state, we add the exponents if we want to keep that same base of 3. So 3 here now is to the power of 4 plus 2, and I'm going to... Uh, rewrite this actually. Let's go all the way out. 2 times a negative 2b minus 2 here, and that's equal 3 to the third power. From there, we have our bases of 3 on each side of the equal sign. So when that happens, we can just set the exponents equal to each other and solve. 4 plus 2 times a negative 2b minus 2 is equal to that exponent of 3. And let's finish solving up here. We're going to solve for b. So 4 stays there, plus, let's distribute this 2 apart, uh, across. 2 times a negative 2b is a negative 4b, and 2 times a negative 2 is a negative 4. And that's equal to just that good old 3. We want to combine our like terms. 4 and a negative 4 added is just a 0. Don't need to write that, so they cancel each other out. We have a negative 4b now is equal to just a 3. Divide both sides by a negative 4. And b is now by itself, and it's equal to a negative 3 fourths, and that is our final answer. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.